Hello, Leo. This is Carrie from Celestial Forecasts with your five minute mini five cast. General advice as always, I'll be pulling from my silhouettes deck as well as my illuminated star tarot. All right, guys, so let's get into your reading here and see what comes through for Leo. All right, so we are starting off with deception, okay? When the smoke clears, the truth will be revealed. So if you're knowing and feeling that someone's being deceptive towards you, maybe they're not being open and honest with you in time, the truth will come out anyway, okay? Let's see what else. So maybe you're already feeling this. We do have a broken feminine. So divine feminine, if you've been dealing with a masculine who hasn't been open with you, and if you know they're being deceptive, that could ultimately have been something that you have found out and it really hurt you. Let's grab another card. dance like no one is watching so i feel if a masculine ended up hurting you divine feminine you might have already moved on from that type of energy to the point where you're more empowered you don't really care whether or not this masculine is in your life you know you're just kind of doing your own thing pursuing your own goals and dreams at this point and then we have this card tranquility in a world of uncertainty and chaos, you are my peace. And you could have certainly felt that about your masculine, but I can't help but feel that the tables have turned, that you now represent that tranquility and peace in their heart and their life, but they messed up. All right, so let's go ahead and see what the tarot messages will bring forward. Angels and spirit guides, please, for Leo. The tables have turned. That's just what I'm getting. So we've got the Eight of Cups, but it is coming up in the reverse. Okay, I feel. And as you can see, it's about leaving someone behind and walking away. So Divine Feminine, if you relate to this, maybe you struggled walking away from your masculine this could be where you're at right now. But if you went through this journey, however difficult that might have been, I feel you still were able to finally get to a point in your life where you decided, you know what, it's not worth staying. It's too chaotic. They're not putting me first. And so you might have gotten yourself out of that situation, however painful it was for you. You know, this is confirming here that it did come to an end. Some of you could have been dealing with a Scorpio here. So the death card is about endings and new beginnings. So maybe this situation, however difficult it was for you to walk away, it did come to an end. And through healing and time, you were able to walk a different path and have a new beginning, certainly when it comes to love and romance or even other parts of your life. And maybe at this point, you've created enough change in your life where you're in a much better position divine feminine you're also coming in with the energy of the queen of swords so the queen of swords is a no-nonsense feminine and you might have ultimately cut your masculine out of your life because they were being deceptive towards you this is simply clarifying that the relationship fell apart because of that deception it didn't have a strong enough foundation and therefore especially divine feminines, it does seem that you cut your masculine out of your life. And now the tables have turned. You represent that peace that is no longer there. That's why their life is in a state of chaos right now. You might have left them out in the cold, you know, but too bad, right? So things are finally escalating and moving for you in your life. And I really do feel I'm picking up off of the energy for my divine feminines. You've created your own movement in your life. You're on a much different path, a much better path in your life. This does represent the fact that you did whatever it took to overcome these challenges with this person. And you've been able to 
have a very successful life here and hopefully a very successful relationship so love romance maybe your career is going very well at this point in time just every aspect of your life doing a lot better because you basically detached from somebody who didn't put you first and you had to put you first okay so i will leave that there guys if this resonates with you which i hope it did that's where i'm going to leave this one if you're interested in your own personal private reading that info is down below i'll see you guys next time take care <music>